Hey guys, what's going on? Animation from Caitlin here, and I'm going to be reacting to a video that is most certainly going to make me cry. Because apparently, Pokemon just kicked out the only people that I actually care about. So, uh, let's get into it. So this is the end of Team Rocket, I guess. We just got Pokemon Journeys episode 145, Team Rocket Strikes Back, and yeah, that, that is just happened, I guess. a freaking hilarious name. Ash and his friends seeing a deadly bird fly overhead, and Brock mentions how it's rare for them to be seeing one where they're at. This Deadly Bird was actually Team Rockets, and it brought them some much- Oh yeah, them! I forgot- I forgot about you, Deadly Bird! We get a nice reunion with all of them, oh. and we back to all of their released Pokemon in a slideshow, basically, but I'm just happy that they got mentioned nonetheless. Team Rocket hatches a plan to use all of their Pokemon Wait, one final time- Wait, why did he give them back? Did they, they get fired? Time, Junior tricking Ash into thinking that it fought with Team Rocket, and it doesn't want to be part of it anymore. Which is probably a foreshadow to the fact that they would disband at the end of it. Excuse so me, what? We gotta see Missy Staryu as well as Brock's Ludicolo for the first time in ages. Oh, Ludicolo. For Nate and Halucha as well. Oh, yay! Yeah. Getting spoiled by the Latias that has been following Ash around, and after one final <laughs> battle, Latias is the one to send them off. If this is their final appearance for real, then I think that it was horribly done. Pikachu should have done the final send off. After Aww. landing from blasting off, Team Rocket fights as they blame one another and then angrily walk away from each other, quote unquote, ending Team Rocket. What? The final moment or so of this episode was then spent showing off what Latias' brother is dealing with, and then the episode ends. There's no way that this is the end of Team Rocket, right? As a standalone episode, you, I they just scream at each other and leave. Team Rocket's story is horrible. Mime Junior was incredibly cute in this one, and James and its relationship is just too amazing. Oh, Mime Junior, I miss it so much. Takeshi's Paradise with Ludicolo and Kroger oh. also really amazing. That Again, if you look at this episode did the not happen. Rocket's final, then I would rate this as one of the worst this did ever. not just Since happen. I'm more than certain that this is not their final appearance. I won't be having that in mind. The I'll be giving this episode an 8 out of 10. They'll come back. It was really fun to get to see They'll come back. There's no actual party. way. I'm using it to their advantage. Well, except more Pekka, who did absolutely nothing, there but not much to be expected. There's no way. The interactions between Team Rocket and their Pokemon was top tier, especially Mime Jr. The OST was great with them. Oh. Even though they Takeshi's Paradise. They even use a Team Rocket's team song from the XY series. Okay, that's actually really freaking funny. And I hope we get to see them again. What did you think of this episode? No, 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 no. Absolutely freaking not. I refuse to believe that was the end of Team Rocket. There's no way they just like, I hate you, see you never again and left. That's not, that's not how this works. That's not how I wanted their ending to be. I wanted the ending to Jesse and James kissing and then just being like, screw Team Rocket, we love each other, and walking away. There's absolutely no way this is the end of them. I refuse to believe it. And if they are not even remotely hinted at in the next series, I will storm Game Freak, riot Nintendo, and light both of the buildings on fire. Because we know for a fact that this image is official. They're gonna end up like this. So why in the actual heck would the ending supposedly of the series be this? To me, this makes absolutely no sense. And if this is the official send-off, then I agree with the person I'm watching narrating that video. This is a freaking terrible send-off. You, They better come back, or that's just gonna be the most disappointing thing in the entirety of anything. Not gonna lie, I'm not nearly as mad about Ash leaving than other people are. In fact, I've been actually kind of excited about the fact that there's gonna be a new protagonist. I mean, I... If you watch my actual reaction video, I was very surprised at how emotional I got because ever since like Hisui and Snow were all of the other, it wasn't like Pokemon Generations, it was like the other one, I forgot which one it was called, it was recent, with the Galar, like all those ones, Ash wasn't in them and yet I was like, I thoroughly enjoy this, I would actually really like it if and the new series centered around somebody else, but like Team Rocket, I... No, absolutely not. You cannot get rid of them. Not like this. This ending is awful. And on top of it, I mean, we know they're technically within the Paldea region borders as Team Rocket, because there are a bunch of weird shorts that have came out recently that have made me really skeptical to the fact that they're leaving too. But at the same time, I feel like them getting all their Pokemon back kind of makes it seem like they totally are, even though I really don't want them to. I mean, why tease them finding the legendary Pokemon of Paldea if, you know, they're just gonna completely not be there ever? So, it's- it's weird, and I want- what do you guys think? Because for me personally, I really hope they don't get rid of Team Rocket, or at least this isn't the final episode they'll be in. Even if they get rid of them, I still want them to have a happier ending rather than just, I hate you, have a nice day. I mean, there are plenty of times in the past where Team Rocket split ways, but they always come back together at the end of the day, right? Right? Nintendo, right? 
Seriously, the fear is rising. But let me know what you guys think in the comments. So don't forget to like, comment your thoughts, subscribe, and stay creative. Bye!